The Inquisition cannot remain a bastard. If she can't prove, it was founded on Justinia's orders. This is an inopportune time, Marquis. More of the faithful flock here each day. But allow me to introduce you to the brave soul who risked his life to slow the magic of the bridge. Sir Trevelyan, may I present the Marquis Durelion, one of Divine Justinia's greatest supporters. And the rightful owner of Haven. House Durelion lent Justinia these lands for pilgrimage. This Inquisition is not a beneficiary of this arrangement. This is the first I've heard of Haven having an owner outside the Chantry. My wife, Lady Machin of Denver, has claimed to Haven by ancient treaty with the monarchs of Ferelden. We were honored to lend its use to divine Justinia. She is a... She was a woman of supreme merit. I will not let an upstart order remain on her holy grounds. Interesting, considering the Inquisition was begun by the left and right hands of the Divine. I've seen no written records from Sister Liliana or Seeker Pentacus that Justinia approved the Inquisition. If he won't take her at her word, I'm afraid Seeker Pentagas must challenge him to a duel. What? It is a matter of honor among the Navarans. Shall I arrange the bout for tonight? No, no. Perhaps my reaction to the Inquisition's presence was somewhat hasty. <sighs> we face a dark time, Your Grace. Divine Justinia would not want her passing to divide us. She would, in fact, trust us to forge new alliances to the benefit of all, no matter how strange they might seem. I'll think on it, Lady Montilier. The Inquisition might stay in the meanwhile. Do the Durelions actually have a claim on this place? His Grace's position is not so strong as he presents it. Despite their Ferelden relations, the Durelions are Orlesian. If the Marquis wishes to claim Haven, Empress Selene must negotiate with the Ferelden on his behalf. Her current concerns are a bit larger than minor property disputes. I apologize for the intrusion. I didn't realize you were meeting with the Marquis. You did little harm. In truth, the debate was most beneficial as practice for those to come. You expect more people in Haven? Undoubtedly and each visitor will spread the story of the Inquisition after they depart. An ambassador should ensure the tale is as complimentary as possible. May I ask what brought you to work for the Inquisition? Sister Leliana approached me. We've been acquainted for quite some time. For better or worse, being the Inquisition's diplomat has become as interesting as she promised. What sort of dealings have you had with nobility? For some years, I was the royally appointed court ambassador from Antiva to Orle. The nobility of Thedas is a rather singular sphere. Those I'm not acquainted with, I know through reputation. The Inquisition is lucky to have you as an advocate, Lady Montillier. Thank you. Let us hope so. Thedas' politics have become... Agitated, as of late. I hope to guide us down smoother paths. But please excuse me. I've much work to do before the day is done. You are the Herald. Or, well, the one they're calling the Herald, anyway. I hope the Inquisition can restore order soon. I never really wanted to leave the Circle. My name is Maneve. I research demons and other creatures. Seeker, Pentagast, and I use what I find to help the soldiers fight them. I found something the demons left behind. Can you use it? Yes, that's very helpful. Just leave it there and the Tranquil and I will examine it. We should use 
that. If you find anything, please bring it in. You've brought back some fascinating things. We're putting them to good use. You said Cassandra has you researching creatures. Yes. If you find anything interesting in your travels, I'd appreciate you bringing it to me. I may be able to find some weakness our soldiers can exploit when fighting various creatures. But at the least, some materials are useful for making potions or gear for the Inquisition. Why did you decide to research dangerous creatures? I like the outdoors. The idea of the outdoors, anyway. When some monster is coming at you, glowing eyes and burning claws, it's terrifying. But once you know how it works, you can deal with it. It's just another part of the world. So much of this world is only frightening because we don't understand it. I'll speak with you later. Thank you again for what you've brought back.
has revealed to me, as there is but one God, one life, one man. You dislike the Templar system? Let all repeat no. the chant of light. Using them later, Segrit is willing to pay. You're back, and in one piece. You said you thought Master Tajan was working on something special. If it helps, I found his notes. <laughs> the old codger was on the edge of a breakthrough here, but he couldn't see it. You want some of these mixed up? You just give the word. How do I go about having potions made? Just take a look there and tell me what you'd like. Find a recipe for something better, I can make that too.